deny ya Make all the demons quiet yeah. We were built to thrive, yeah I think that we've all had enough What keeps you up at night, yeah Make all the demons quiet, yeah We were built to thrive, yeah Welcome to PXC, everybody, where we have special guest commentators Shane Henry Help. and never mind, he got fired immediately. Uh, <laughs> and then we also have from MTW Death as well. Death, welcome to the commentary. Yo, what's up? We do not have his picture, so we'll be waiting for like another 20 years before uh, he's actually in the booth. That as well, he is. He's he's fucking he's fucking disgusting. Like, you got, you have Fuck no idea. You have no idea how horrified I am of death and his appearing. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm so, I'm so appalled. He's, he's the most, most horrifying being in all existence. But with that said, ladies and gentlemen, we have an action pack show here tonight, mainly because it is the beginning of our road to Operation PXT. Now, yes, the name sounds bleh, but it's actually a dedication of our very first episode of PXT that happened, I believe now, six years ago. Um, that shit started it all. PXT has gone through Mixer, a little bit of Twitch, not so long with Twitch, and it's now seeing its uh, resurgence here on YouTube, and honestly, it has been a fucking hell of a goddamn ride. Uh, now, this past Monday, we had bankrupt. Bankrupt, a lot of shit fucking happened. A lot of fucking title changes happened. Where both TikTok and Hardcore Championships were actually fucking uh, attained by new competitors. Uh, one of them being Michael Wolf, who is actually defending the Hardcore Championship tonight against Corey X. But that's not even the only titles that got switched. It was also the beginning of Bankrupt to where it was G7 against Titan for the YouTube Championship to where Titan shocked the world and actually put down G7 and became the YouTube Champion. Well, G7 is already invoking his rematch clause. In other words, tonight it will be G7 and Titan the rematch for the YouTube Championship and whoever wins will go on to Operation to face Iron Maiden. I, I for some reason I was about to say another word, and I was like, "Wait, on, that was the wrong one." Nope. But either way, um, that is pretty much what's going on here tonight. But tonight, ladies and gentlemen, we're starting off with our own PXC Women's Champion, Ava Moreno. Ava Moreno pulled off a like honestly a do or die shit um, this past like week. Besides, uh, wait, wait, okay, just checking. I was seeing if I was actually. Uh, um, she was able to pull off like the hugest upset in the world because everyone was really hoping that Emma Reyes was going to pick up the PXC Women's Championship. Ava stomped that dream into the ground. And now she has to look forward to her opponent at Operation, which is none other than Alexia Jimenez. The queen herself. I'm about to say the biggest badass bitch here, but really it's she's just the queen of PXT. So with that said, she's actually here to make a statement tonight. So she is having an open challenge here to start off us here in PXT. <laughs> nice cut. <cow>. What? <laughs> All right, now, Ava, I, I gotta say this, guys. Ava has surprised the hell out of me. <laughs> she is. Pepper spray because every time I spray her, it doesn't work, so I need two bottles. Oh, yeah, she, she built her immune system to it. You didn't know that? She's a crazy bitch, man. Well, of course she's a crazy bitch. I mean, she's she, she was able to like live her lifelong dream, and she's over here with fucking uh, wait, I just, wait, I just realized how come she doesn't come out with wait, hold up, wait a minute. I just realized something. Why is she not coming out with both titles? Huh, I just oh, realized there's that. No, there's no woman uh, double title in here. Yeah, there was. She came out with it the other night. Mm. Don't ask me questions, man. I am so lost right now. Either way. Oh, oh. Fuck away. I had the pepper spray ready. I think that's what the fingers underneath was. She was like, you gonna try it again? You gonna do it again? Try it again. Oh. <laughs> 
And with that, Shane has uh, officially died. He's no longer with us. Uh, good luck. <laughs> I will say this. Your smile is actually a lot creepier now. <laughs> he looks fine. Is She's swinging. I'm scared. That's not even a swing. This fucking crazy bitch. But now the question is, who's gonna answer the call? Well, it looks like it's none other than Catherine Jackson here tonight, looking to make a statement. Well, she was able to. <sighs> The midget is controlling the tank. We've said this multiple times. There's not even a midget in there. It's just no. some like little oh. guy here. Carl's oh. on Carl isn't even in here. He's the goddamn ring announcer. He's controlling no, I'm not, the I'm tank. I'm here. God damn it. No, I'm not, guys. I'm right here. Hey, I'm just driving the tank. Who's driving the tank, though? I said it! It's a little person! Or it's a But he's right here. Oompa loompa topa de do. What the fuck? What is your entrance? It's so damn long. Hurry the fuck up! Well, someone's Jackson. testing. Also, also, I want to point out something here uh, to everyone watching tonight. This isn't even the only show tonight on NTW. Survival of the Fittest will be going live, uh, I believe, an hour after our show ends here tonight. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Survival of the Fitness is going to be an interesting show because it, all matches are going to be for all titles. And the main event is D-Mob going one-on-one -on -one against the MTW World Champion Electro to see if he can yeah. right or wrong that happened at the MTW tournament. That was like a long time ago as well. Hell yeah, it was. But you know what? Hey, he's, he won a more contendership shot. So in other words, we're going to see what happens with that. But anyway, back to the action. Uh, Catherine started off strong. Ava, though, gained the upper hand. I think showing a little bit of inexperience. <laughs> well, hold on, wait a minute. Let's talk death within this. How long has Catherine been going? Is she is she like new to the whole wrestling scene, or has she been going for a while? Uh, she been going for a while in the indie scenes before she came to the um to, to the picture. The YouTube scenes, you know. Ava kind of looks like Selena Vega. She does. Z Z and Zanina this is <laughs> this is where it keeps happening again. Everyone's at the other people. Oh, it looks good though. It looks good on me. That attire looks cool. Okay. I was gonna say. Oh, well, can't kicks keep up. Multiple kicks to the gut. That happened like 20 minutes ago. But now, oh, beautiful arm drag into a drop kick. And right now, oh, and there is Ava looking to make a statement here and looking to make Captain Jackson tap out to that submission hole that she's made famous. Now, what's it called? That's an excellent question. I think it's the <laughs> SCA or something. I forget. Is the STL? I don't know. Slade's total love. No, Slade love me. SL. SLM. Slade love me. SLM, it's the, know. it's you. I don't even know what you said. It sounded like you, you, you fucking mic. Yeah, that's the SLM. You said like, isn't it? You sound like you were on a computer. Because like I'm fucking dumbass. You said SLM. What the fuck is SLM? I said SM. Wait. Slade's <laughs> muscles. I don't know. I don't know. I, I forgot the L. I'm not good with letters. We need to write her moves down, <laughs> at least for her, because we come up, we come up with it and then we lose it constantly. Or we can do I love Slade, the ILS. ILS it is. <laughs> right now, Catherine Jackson is in control of this whole matchup right now. Really is, man. A little bit, but it, right when you said that, Ava's now taking control and uses her own maneuver on her, the arm drag into a sitting position to a drop kick. And now with a senton, Ava it's a really cool coming it's back a into it, and again gets her Damn. in the SLM. I thought it was 
ILS. Whatever. <laughs> Carl, shut up. Either one, it works. Yeah, shut the fuck up, Carl. I, th I think SLM works. I don't want to oh. shut up. Fuck y'all. You're, you're a fucking guest commentator. You can't fire anyone. Hey, no, I fired you. You want? Do you want proof? Me. You want proof? I can fire All everybody. Right, oh I'm shit! All right, oh. spinning code breaker is that enough to put down the PXC Women's Champion? No, it is not. You want Panthers bite? It, 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 it clicked. I, I, it no, 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 no. You ruined it. You ruined it. You ruined, you ruined it. it. Shane always ruined Butterfly it. Butterfly DDT guys. looking to pin. Avon Randall does not get it. Ruined it. Ruined it. I know. <laughs> ruined it. No, I'm just. Shane, I know. Shane's an idiot. Ruined it. Like Shane. Bad Shane. Shane. Ah, Shane, Shane always. Shane always makes mistakes. Hey, look, I, I didn't fuck up something, now. finally. Uh. Carl, don't you fuck wallets? Yes. <laughs> oh, big fucking top rope splash straight to the torso of the champ. Is that another put Ava down? No, Ava's still going. Damn. That was a full no body splash, though. <laughs> Dude, that was a full body splash, man. Is she an Ava swing? Because damn. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, so there is something I gotta say. What what could the win here tonight do for Catherine? A lot, man. A lot. She can prove that she beat the women's champion and br maybe earn herself a spot in like maybe a triple threat match. Daniel Bryan, Randy Orton, Randy Orton. Yeah, no, no. Situation. What? How? What? <laughs> How is that? Oh, man, that, would, that would that would not happen. <laughs> if anything, she'd be next in line, maybe. But uh, I wouldn't say you would put it as that. <laughs> I'm trying. I can I'm tell. Shut <laughs> the fuck up. You've been doing this for a lot longer than me. <laughs> I've been doing this for how long? How old has it been since the, like the last, like the first six episode of PXT? Years. Ah, six months. Fuck you. <laughs> Actually, I think it's like six seven, seven, eight. Episode. I don't know. That was the first ever episode I did of PXT in a nutshell. They had to commentate that thing. Yes, yeah, six. All right, looks like she's going with Slade's love into the corner. Is that another for Catherine Jackson out of commission? One, two, two. no. Catherine kicks out. Catherine, Catherine very brutal move. Here. Very, very brutal move. I think Ava's starting to get a little frustrated, starting to stomp on the chest of Catherine. Now thinking of going high. Girls, I want to see men. What? Wait, 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 wait. You want what now? That's wildfire, by the way. I know, but what is it? Uh, you, 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 hold on. Say I wanna, and then say that thing all in one word. He said, "Girls, I want to see men." No, 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 no. Say, say the last two very quick. Nope, men. Oh God damn. <laughs> There you go. There you go. <laughs> I'm good. All right. And Ava's now going again with a submission. Oh, Catherine! No hesitation, actually. Immediately gets out of it. I think Catherine's learning the offense of the PXC Women's Champion here. He was going for the SLM, but Catherine didn't like it. And got out very goes under, goes over, and now again with the arm drag into a drop kick. I think that cartwheel she could, does. Whee! Could this could this be it? Could this be Catherine's shot to show the world that she could be next in line for a PXC women's shot? Maybe, man. Maybe you never know. Oh. Oh, she's, she's going to the top. The she's going to the top. Catherine with a big elbow straight across the chest of Ava Moreno. Here it is. One, One uh, two, two, no. Ava still kicks out. Yeah. I'm actually impressed right now. <laughs> a lot of height on those maneuvers. Oh, Catherine was trying to set up something. Ava, though, stopping it. And now going for the biggest wizard. Is that enough? Oh, it's Chinese wizard. I can't say that because it's an extra move. One, two. two. Three, it's enough to put Catherine Jackson out of commission. Damn. 
Hey, Emma, make you a save of showing how there are no cracks in her PXC women's shit. Oh, well, look who's here! It's Alexia Yamenez! Yamenez, you're an amazing. Oh my statement. god. It's a fucking dude. It's a size difference. Oh my god. Yeah, Your menace, Ava Moreno. <laughs> the two will face off at Operation PXT. Holy sh. God damn, dude. I see. I knew there was a size difference. I didn't know how big the size difference was. That's, that's, that's a giant difference. Damn, dude. That's fucking crazy. Well, either way, congratulations to Ava and, and Hell. This takes nothing away from uh, the one and only Kathy Jackson. Because either way, cause she was she was fucking going all in. But Ava, Ava just had way more in it. On in 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 it in it in it. Yeah. Yes. It. Either way, on to the next uh, match we have set up. So we've been hearing some, uh, well, correction, technically on X or Twitter. I'm, I'm still calling it Twitter. On Twitter, uh, Lawler took out or went to Twitter to pretty much uh, let out his little frustrations with the syndicate. I, I hate that I said little. But either way, he let out his frustrations saying he's out, uh, possibly indicating that he might want to be leaving the syndicate. Um, nothing has been fully responded to from Satoshi himself, so as far as we know, Baller might want out of the Syndicate. Uh, not sure where that's going, not sure what Satoshi's thinking about it, but Lawler demanded a match here tonight, and who did we put him up against? That is an excellent question. We went to everyone that we can think of, and there was only one person that we thought of, mainly because he has been doing open challenges recently, and we haven't seen him in, actually, I think a pretty good while. So, tonight, ladies and gentlemen, it is Jake Lawler going one-on-one -on -one against Mike Evans here tonight. One thing I'm going to say is, the last time someone wanted out of the Syndicate, they got fucked up by a metal pipe? PXC's Raquel. Oh, your menace? Maybe. <laughs> nah, I would say she's a... Uh, I don't know, she's up there, though. But to Lawler... I, so here's the thing. Uh, the Syndicate started off super strong, and it looked like it was headed towards a bright future for Lawler, Cassidy, and Satoshi. The thing is, though, after Carnage, they really fucking dropped. Like, really dropped. That's like peaking in middle school. How do you do that? Pretty much, yeah. But no, the thing is, though, Lawler, like, Satoshi has not, like, failed on any of the promises. He promised title opportunities. But I'm assuming what Lawler thought of was not opportunities. I think he thought of it as gold. As in, he will be winning the gold and everything like that. And right now, Lawler hasn't really seen any of that lawler hasn't had any gold he's one of the originals that hasn't seen a title shot since hell i think uh, abyss? well no because he didn't even well technically before abyss uh that was when him and cj went one-on-one -on -one to where again cj laid out the self-proclaimed god of wrestling well, that's it i mean people but Hunter the only thing is there's been many people who have been uncrowned champions and I'm gonna be honest I don't think Lawler is one of them but wait what <laughs> There's, there's many uncrowned champions. No, 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 no. I get, I get that, but the way, the way you worded that made it seem like we missed a match at the record books the way he did win a title. That, that's no, how. No, that's, no. That's, yeah, no, that's no, how. No, I was, no, that's no, how I was no, like, no, wait, what? I've never held the title, but I have. You know, one time MTW, one time tag. So suck it, bitches. Back the MTW one doesn't count. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we did just barely start, so this is barely our second match of the night. Um, we now, now we do have two title matches tonight. We do have the hardcore title being defended from by Michael Wolf against Corey X, who's I believe is making this PXC debut here tonight with that. And then we have the YouTube title uh, being defended here as well. A rematch from G7 versus Titan. Yeah. Excuse me. 
<laughs> Lawler looking. Lawler looking for a fresh start. Probably looking for what he, I would. Just, oh, well, I think he, he would assume as an easy win against someone like Mike Evans. God damn, Many big knee also, shot. God, I had the hiccups. Sorry. Many people also really underestimate Mike Evans a lot, man. Oh, no, that's true. Honestly, Mike Evans has surprised a lot of us. Sorry about that. Death is back now, and I have uh, yeah, death took a call. very long while with that. Oh, I didn't, yeah. oh, I didn't even know you were gone. <laughs> phone call, you, I'm sorry. Because usually you're say. silent. No, yeah, you're good. Um, yeah, it's an interview. No, you're good. Anyway. Anyway. Oh shit! Big brain buster from Lawler to <laughs> oh, Evans. Oh my god! Damn. Now, who do you guys got for this match? I got Evans. Honestly, I think the one that needs the win a little bit more. Sadly, is Lawler. I hate saying that, but it's it's mainly because Lawler, since he wants to, or he's implying of leaving the syndicate. I think he really needs this type of win because he it's does. it's a restart, it's a fresh slate, it's out of the syndicate. But now the thing is, with Satoshi, is he gonna allow that? Because we never seen Satoshi like deal with somebody wanting to leave the syndicate. We've seen what he does to people that he doesn't see of use to the syndicate no more. Ace. Yeah, but besides that, I mean, we we haven't seen how he handles people wanting to leave. Oh, the same way he handles people who suck. Oh shit! Mike Evans coming in with a big fucking Damn. headlock against Lawler on the outside. Tosses him over. Listen, I am so gr glad glad that Cyclone went went with went with the pattern for this match, but it's. For this show, because Wait, with the party with this one, what? Oh, okay, see, this proves you do not remember the shows then, because you're over here saying Rush was the last show. One. God damn it! Damn, big spine bust. What was it? Three shows ago. <laughs> Wait, hold on, was two shows no. <laughs> you know what? Time flies, okay. I've been Matthew, you, you are a terrible. Boy. <laughs> you are a terrible timekeeper. <laughs> <laughs> you don't say. <laughs> Lawler going for the pin shit. on Evans. All right, only gets a two count. Oh, you going for the comeback? Oh, Lawler was looking to rally. Oh my God, big gut shots and comes in with sweeping the leg of Evans. Yeah. Right now, Lawler Oof. is in it, and oh, 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 big running knee from. Mike Evans, but Lawler thinking smart. His hand was underneath the rope. He's not even wasting any energy from kicking out. I have the hiccups. That's why I'm silent right now. <laughs> that was just random, but okay. <laughs> People are going to be like, oh, where's Shane? Shane has the hiccups. I, I don't know. I, mean, I, don't, I think they were fine. Because <laughs> I don't think anybody has, like, where's de death. They were just like, oh, he's quiet. No. Um, I'm still here. But see, people I'm actually just, like, like Shane. Yeah, Shane. Right. Yeah, people like Shane. People just don't like death. Evan's <laughs> rolling in. Now Evans at the top going in with a big elbow. He's trying to get it on the spine of <laughs> Lawler. Lawler, though, not allowing it to happen. Oh, damn it, dude. Oh, another big brain buster. From Those Lawler to Evans. Man. They're really hurting them. And them brain busters go be go get them percussion. I am not getting any mic satisfaction from this. God damn it. It's not even a good field goal. Ah, uh, damn it. Right now, Lawler. Just choking the living hell out of Evans. And now going to the top. I think Lawler's thinking of ending this. Oh! I it forgot what we called that. Was it godly disrespect, I think? I think, yeah. Oof. The godly disrespect. I can't get up like that. Oh, wait, what's he going? Oh! What are going for? A submission maneuver looking to make Evans tap out here tonight. Give him the victory. Will Evans tap, though? No, Evans is actually getting out of it right when you asked that. Oh, all are missing. No, Evans. Evans throwing Lawler over the top rope. Now looking. 
to go high risk. Oh, oh, yeah, with a big go. oh my god, top rope suicide dive. Holy <laughs> shit. And the crowd's chanting, this is awesome. Holy shit. And a big sling blade from Evans into a drop kick. God, Evans PXT. PXT. Evans oh isn't holding God. anything back. I think Evans is treating this like a big match. Because you think Lawler has had big successful matches. So knocking him off could probably kickstart Evans for probably having bigger matches as well. Evans is also trying to prove himself. He's trying to prove that he can beat big contenders. Yeah, that is what he's seeing it as. I think he's seeing it like that now. Looking to damage the knee of Lawler. Not a bad idea because Lawler really does favor the knees when it comes to his offense. Play that smart. Now, big neck breaker on the outside. God damn. Oh, God. I don't know. Evans needs to get Lawler back in the ring if he wants it. And right when I say that, he immediately takes him back in the ring. Now, can he take advantage of it? Oh, big snap DDT. Dear Lawler God. barely getting up. And Evans not giving up the fight. Giving everything he got. So gets Lawler in the corner. Big chop in the corner. Now, damn, gets him up. Damn. Oh, my God. Big punch straight across the face. Lawler tumbles to the ground. Damn. Evan, <laughs> what the fuck? Evan's just beating the living shit out of him. Like he, he's not even going for like big moves. He's just being. Oh god, that's what I was talking about. That knee. Yeah, but he's damaged it a little bit. That might hurt Lawler a little more than it hurt Evans. Oh, I think Evans. Looking for oh, final call Ooh. is that it? One, two, no! Lawler kicks out. Bam! Brutal move. And the crowd chanting like one more time. Hell, these guys are already stealing the show. Holy shit! And oh, misses a frog Ooh. splash. Can Lawler get the upper Got hand it. here? What was Lawler going for? Lawler going in for oh. Big sliding kick straight to the temple of Evans, but Evans rolls out. Playing it smart. Oh, well, Lawler's playing a little bit of mind games. Evans, though, now taking the advantage of those mind games. Lawler, though, switching it up, getting out of danger. And now, oh, my God, another fucking knee. But this time to the gut. Oof. Or it looked like the ribs, actually, of Evans. And now just choking the living life of him at the that bottom. The God damn, dude. Oh, wait. Oh, Lawler thinks that's enough to put Evans out. No, Evans kicks out. Lawler played it smart with that knee to the ribs. He knew if he hit him with that, Lawler would have some trouble breathing, and then choking him out would maybe give him the pin. I, 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 think, I, think, I think you, I think it's, I think you mixed up, mixed up who got hit in the ribs. <laughs> yeah. I probably, <laughs> hey, I just... probably did, because Shane's fucking dumb. Oh, wait, here it is. Godly Law on Mike Evans. Is that enough? Oof. One. One. Two. Two. Three. And Lawler gets the win. But man, you can't take anything away from Evans. With this amazing match. God damn it. I just love it. Alright, oh, either way, congratulations to Law. Wait, wait, what's going on? What the fuck? Oh, someone's going on. Oh, someone's going on with my shit. Don't hang in a sec. Uh. Ah, what happened? Ah! Something's going on. Life's play. Ah, what's the. Okay, now what's going on? Ah! Ah! Konnichiwa! Jake Lola! Yo, Is that Satoshi? Wish leave syndicate. We talk next week. Sayonara, Lola. <laughs> Damn, that was Satoshi. Satoshi How the fuck up? He fucked up my camera, though. What the fuck? <laughs> It was this god damn it, that motherfucker! What was that for? <laughs> Dick. Why do you sound like a bitch? <laughs> I, can get the shit out of I know, he, he sounded like an actual bitch. What the fuck? Well, I mean that's that's Lawler, I guess getting what he wanted. 
the fuck were you doing? <laughs> you just sprayed up ran off though. <laughs> <laughs> like was, <laughs> pretty much, yeah. He fucked with my. He was fucking with all the settings and shit. I guess he was trying to get his video up or whatever. <laughs> but he fucked up my video. <laughs> Thanks, asshole. <laughs> all right. So I guess we'll be hearing more about this whole thing from Lawler and Satoshi sometime next week. I guess I had that. That's a little weird. Remember the battles the unholy and the syndicate have had. Oh yeah. But now, speaking of tag teams, this past fucking Monday on oh. fucking Bankrupt, holy shit. That was uh, a week. The PXC, the PXC tag team titles were vacated by the War Machines, who have disbanded to go on their separate ways. Goddamn. We decided to crown the new championships, uh, new champions at Bankrupt in another Bond match, to where it was the Unholy. Wait, was it the Unholy? Who the fuck was in that match? Hold <laughs> <laughs> on, wait. No, it was not the Unholy. It was the Syndicate. It was Lucid Dragons and Domination going against a mutt of a team of Bugrip Grip and Rodrigo. Two men who have hated each other for the longest fucking time have apparently put aside their differences and now became a team to then go on and become the PXT Tag Team Champions. But now with that said, no more contenders for those titles are still the Lucid Dragons because they were promised a one-on-one -on -one for the titles. So that will be happening at Operation PXT. But which team gets the stipulation for the match? That's an excellent question. So tonight, we are doing what we normally do with the tag teams. It is one-on-one -on -one action between one member of both teams, and it will be seeing the other two members go on later tonight. So tonight, ladies and gentlemen, it will be Corey Dreams from Lucid Dragons going against Bugrip Grip from Menace. That's their name. Uh, yes. They, they told me to still workshopping it. Just hold your breath for like 20 minutes. No, because no, then I die. Exactly. No, die. Wow. As, as far as we can tell, Satoshi does not know how to work fucking technology. Sorry, that still bothers me. Got my fucking head. He did. Carl, you better, um, announce these teams right now. Wait, why is he announcing the team? Uh, stop for the tag I know, I know, I know. My brand is fucking I'll make my own PXT merch to be honest. That'd be pretty sick, actually. PXT. I would like there to be PXT merch. I think it'd be pretty cool. Thing is, though, I have to get the font. Because <laughs> really, that's what I want to do. I want to get, like, the font I use for the thumbnails on, like, this version of PXT and everything. Because I feel like that'd be a lot cooler than the font that we have on here. This is the pain in the ass to get it there. Now, Koi Dreams. Now, uh, here's the thing. A lot of people, even in this commentary booth, have been saying Dreams has been getting fucking carried by <laughs> Drew Jeffrey. <laughs> Yeah, he's sure you. Look, look, he he been holding his own in one on one action. He was able to get a Drew one on one Kevin. win. Drew Those tattoos are too damn bright. Too uh, too damn colorful. Hey, look, man, he likes the color on his tats. What the fuck? <laughs> All I'm gonna say is, I'm gonna say. It. My my hatred for Drew oh. is like the corn. Hey, oh, look at this. This is Rodrigo, the man that soloed the win for Menace. Look at that tag championship around his waist. I think both men are happy on this occasion because both men, former PXC champions, now PXC tag team champions. A duo I, see, I, n I never thought I'd see. That is a dangerous duo. Oh, epically. Dominate. More of a domination. I stubbed my toe. 
Well, Dream Honey looks ready for his match, even though it's Bugrip fighting right now. <laughs> Beer gets a lot more color, right? Beer gets a lot more hype. Uh -huh. Hey, look, there's a reason he's the blue menace of PXT. Those are some beautiful gold around them, too. It's you silver, you dumb you fuck. No, I'm joking. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. Fuck you, Rodrigo. I I still am amazed that these two were able to pick up a win for those damn titles. Hey, I need this guy's workout. <laughs> hey, we're in the same gym. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Corey. Okay, Corey, okay. <laughs> I think I think Bugrip told him to go hit it with your first best shot, and that's what happened there. And now going in for our guillotine submission hold off of Bugrip. I think Bugrip May have, oh, bit off more you can chew, but either way, oh! Not a very big slam, but enough to get out of the guillotine hold. That's a cool spine buster. Bear hug spine buster? Dang. Oh, hey, but dreams now. Oh my god, god damn, okay! Shit! Practically launching Bugrip with a fucking suplex. <laughs> No, Here. no, oh yeah. no, going in for a Boston, or oh, an inverted Boston crab, actually. But who do we have for this one? Do we have? Um, honestly, I, <laughs> I generally have no idea, because I'll be honest with you, I didn't, I never pictured Bugrip and Rodrigo winning the PXD tag titles. So, bring, bring, like, legitimately breaking fourth wall here, I never thought they were actually going to win. I thought it would have been funny, which it is, but... <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm amazed that they actually won the bitch. I'm just happy because it's not. So it's not dumb. <laughs> well, either way. Well, they were the random fuckers. What do you mean? No, 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 no. Corey's the random fucker. How, how is he the random fucker? He just he debuted with Drew. He just debuted with Drew. In the tag match, and then he gets carried. His ass gets carried, not once, but twice. I mean, here's the thing, though. There's only so much that Drew was able to carry, though. Because here's the thing: if we're looking at Corey, like solo wise, he's actually very, extremely strong in one-on-one -on -one combat that we're seeing even right now. Because he's actually putting the former PXT champion like through a lot of punishment right now. So what I'm hearing is the dragons need to mostly work on. Oh wait! Oh, to... oh, but Rodrigo! Oh, Rodrigo! Actually helping Bugrip in this, distracting Corey so that Bugrip can gain the upper hand, and now looking to hit Corey with the un. Oh my gosh! Oh, Already with the unforgiving, he hit every single fucking turnbuckle on the way down. Oh. Yeah. That was unforgivable, but yeah, oh my god. I damn, he's fucking head. Then he continues the offense with a fucking punt. Oh, fuck. He's dead. He is dead. Oh my god. Oh, he's dead. Dude, all That's a dead his. Man. He's able to kick out, though. Oh my god. Oh, gets caught with a big clothesline straight to the corner. Damn. He cannot fucking catch a break. He God, cannot, the Mike. Turn, he got hit, he got hit the same turnbuckle he hit on the way down. Dude, Corey got fucked by that unforgivable. Uh, Drew, uh, could you clip that and, uh, you know. Oh, wait, oh! Bugle was trying to go for a cross-body dive, but Corey catching him! Ow! Drops him with a big power slam! <laughs> but Bugle immediately gets back up! Damn. And then no Corey's taking. Well, Corey's. Well, Corey's taking a sec right now. And now, yes. oh, but now getting caught in a death press. And now, Bugrip just gaining the upper hand. And now, just again choking the life of Corey Dreams. Oof, oof, oof. And continues just choking the life out of him. Goddamn. 
Doesn't yeah. like the man Corey though. Kicking Bugrip off, trying to get some offense off of him, and now goes with the pin. But Bugrip immediately kicks out at one. Corey, you can count to ten with Corey. I think he'll be good. Oh, I think Corey's though. Looking to go for night, night off of Bill Grip, and that might be it. Night, night, it's not. It's definitely not. One, two, no. Bill Grip kicks out. It's definitely not night, night. Corey should have night, night with with his head hitting each fucking damn turnbuckle. Yeah, I'll be honest with you. I don't know how he's alive right now. Now, oh, drops him over head first on the top rope there. And right now, Bugrip skating up ahead, and now Bugrip just busts open. Corey, and another. Dang. Well, this time a knee Dang. shot. Damn. Straight to the face, and Corey has to roll out. So, uh, who would that win in this? Oh, <laughs> it looks like Bugrip's going for another. Unfor oh, no, what's trying over another unforgivable Corey, though? Getting out of danger and catching him with a big boot! Wait, but Rodrigo! Now distracted Corey and goes in with a big leg sweep! Is that enough to put him out? One! Two! No, Corey kicks out! The resilience of Corey! That was a chop block, not a leg sweep. Has it worked? And now, oh, gets caught up, Bill Grip! Is that enough? One! Two! Three and Bugrip gains the victory here! Corey is dead. Get the, get the, get the EMTs out, man. Rodrigo, well, let's not lie here. Rodrigo well, really helped fucking Bugrip. He did. We're gonna see them two four. We're gonna see two former rivals get super buddy buddy with each other now that they both own gold. God damn. And Drew, honestly, Drew didn't help at all in that match. In other words, I, I'm thinking what we're seeing is uh, possibly, possibly... The downfall. I wouldn't say the downfall, but I would say just Drew maybe having second thoughts about Corey as a tag partner. And picking up a random guy off the streets. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah, the blue fuck sky one! What? <laughs> what the fuck? Blue fuck sky one? God damn it. Either way, uh, ladies and gentlemen, it has been a while since we've seen CJ compete here in PXT. Um, he has finally decided to compete again in PXT, trying to get back into the title picture shot, but not just that, just wanting to take on the best here in PXT. So tonight, ladies and gentlemen, we decided to put CJ against one new up and comer because CJ wanted to see what new talent has to bring here the PXC and that is none other than Mac himself you guys friend one I mean yeah <laughs> totally. Totally. Mac looks ready see Jill coming to the ring wait wait wait, wait, wait one damn minute it's small burrito it's small burrito's now attacking see Jill the fuck is he doing Smooth Burrito just attacked the White Viper of Russia! Why'd he do that? Mac. Mac might beat C. Jill with that help. Daisy. Oh! Oh! Both men coming in with big knee shots! Holy shit! Okay, actually, that, that looked pretty sick. That looked pretty sick. C. Jill looking like he won the exchange, though. Here's the thing about the White Viper of Russia that <laughs> we haven't really seen in a while, actually. Ever since he yeah, lost the Frostbite, we haven't seen a lot of CJ. And now the He's pure... <laughs> God damn, dude, the, beard, the pure dominance of CJ. That's why I was shocked that fucking Smooth would attack someone like CJ. Why did Smooth attack to begin with? I'm surprised Seed Smooth. I mean, I did hear recently that he's cleared to compete again, but it looks like he might be calling out the White Viper of Russia. Damn. Oh, Damn, what God. What happened? See, Jill was attacked. Attack. Yeah, see, Jill was attacked by Smooth Marino himself. But who was this Mac guy? Mac is uh, actually, well, made from uh, Zach. He's, he's Zach's character. 
Great question. Smooth's got a death wish. Honestly, I'm actually interested to see how that would go. Oh, it gets him with a big heel kick! That damn heel kick. And he meet Mac, he already busted open Mac, dude. You attack the white viper, he just gets pissed. Oh my god! He <laughs> did Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> the angle, the angle doesn't hide shit, and it was, it was just him punching him straight up in the fucking face. <laughs> and continues the fucking offense, oh my god! Yo, yo, that is CJ on 2K24. Damn, damn, damn! <laughs> oh wait, look, I think Max trying to fight back though. Don't, Max, just don't. Oh wait, oh big, oh my god damn, big clothesline off of fucking CGL. Oh wait, I think Mac was trying to go, oh, rally, but gets caught with a big lift knee. And now CGL's on the top rope. Oh, oh gets it with a stop. Rope. Gets it with a stop straight to the chest and now goes with a pin off Mac. One, two, two. Mac kicks out. Mac, just give up. Mac, just give up. Oh, oh, oh see, Jill. She just not want to hit back now. Coming in with the palm shots straight to the face. My God, dude, Mac's getting massacred right now. Mac, why did you? See, Jill's That's another worldly you. being. Dear God, he's dead. See, Jill. I think see, Jill made this. This just may have pissed off the man more than anything. Oh wait, there oh wait, Mac, Mac's looking to put in some fight, if you will, and Ooh. oh, oh, Ooh. big shot right there to CJL, now looking, the body set up CJL for a big powerbomb! That was the Mac Dear bomb, God. now I want to point out, CJL did lose the title like that, he got hit by multiple powerbombs, and that was enough to take him out of commission. Mac was playing smart then. He was, but the problem was, I think he took too long to capitalize from it. Ooh, big knee yeah. shot, and see Jill immediately rolls to the outside. That, that is a go to sleep. Oh, now another, oh, another heel kick. Dear God, another one. Yeah, no, the Get heel kicks. Down, <laughs> the heel kicks for fucking see Jill, man. Yeah, count that's of three. His, that's his bread and butter, if you know what I mean. Oh, God. Kicking him in the fucking face. <laughs> See, Chill's just not holding anything back, man. <laughs> oh, but here is Mac. Know, Mac, though, mean? fighting his ass off. Don't, Mac. 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 Back right, count of Bring six. Max. Me. Max, I think going back to the ring. Big Mac. Count of seven. Is he do is he pulling in a dinosaur ab call, whichever one? Uh I don't know. It's a count of eight. Neither men are in the fucking thing. They just wanna beat the shit out of each other. Yep, no. Oh wait, oh no, oh it's a count of nine, but Mac wants to beat C Jill! Breaks the count! <laughs> He doesn't want to be. <laughs> He's not pulling in a Donis here tonight, ladies and gents. He wants to beat C Jill! <laughs> The only man that's able to beat C. Jill one on one combat was G7 himself, to where C. Jill showed his respect towards G7 by joining him. Oh, he got some back up. Oh god! Jill, oh my god! Dear God! But C. Jill was also a hypocrite because he counted Slade out. He said, as far as my understanding goes, from what he said, it was. Oh my god! Dear God! Big driver to the outside. Damn! I legitimately do not know what the count's at. We're at a count of seven. Mac, you're dead. Mac, you're, it you're, looks you're, like C. Jill. I think C. Jill's giving Mac mercy at this point. We're at a count of nine. I'm gonna be honest with you, that was him showing mercy. That was him showing mercy. mercy. <laughs> Let's be honest here. Mac was going to die if the match continued. Mac was going to die if the match continued. Let's be honest here. <laughs> that was show of mercy. Mm. NC Jill. Dude, smooth.
Smooth said, Mercy My Ass. Mercy My Ass. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> did we not just see what happened to Mac? <laughs> did we not see the strikes? That was a show of fucking yeah. mercy. Dude, he was about to die. Ow. To be oh, fair, no. Mac could have won. Mac 100% could have won. That's his power bomb, but he couldn't capitalize. He, he, did, he could not have capitalized on the power bomb. If he hit it, if he was able to go straight into the pin fort, he would have done it. He pulled an electrope. Uh, who hasn't? <laughs> I was gonna say he pulled a Rodrigo. Rodrigo was the first one to do it, actually. But he, he, he did it during a title match. Uh, Super was in a tournament. I'm talking about like live PXC shows. Technically, Rodrigo is the first one to do it, but Rodrigo did it like in the big title match. And he was fucking stupid with the counter. So, Smoot Reno has made his fucking call. He wants to see Jill. You fucking dumbass. <laughs> I, mean, I don't know. I think it's going to be epic. I actually, I'm more, curious to see how that goes. Uh, get the more, more, get the funeral home, get the uh, burial site, man, because this is about to be a fucking murder. <laughs> oh my god. Mac, uh, Mac doesn't get the win that he wanted, though. Honestly, uh, that match was a bit more like side by side, but at the end there with that driver, yeah, no, Mac was gonna die if the match like continued yeah, more. Was, it was, it was from the beginning, dog. Put those fucking, beating the shit out of him. That is what happens. That is what happens when you fucking piss off the white viper, man. And he, oh, he oh, <laughs> hitting worse from Mac. <laughs> Look what Smooth said. Calling for an MMA style match at Operation EXT. I think um, we can set that up. We can set that up. I know where to set that up. I mean, that's also it. I mean, no one see Joey fight. <laughs> but there's a way you can set that up. So, uh, KO is submissions? Yeah. In a steel cage. Yeah. But now, but now, ladies and gents, it is time to see. If Michael Wolf can defend the PXC Hardcore Championship against Corey X. Now, if I'm correct, I think, if I'm correct, I believe this is Corey's debut or not? Like, his, I believe this is his debut to where he actually gets an entrance. It's not him chosen randomly, if I remember correctly. Man, dude, I missed watching CGL fucking fight. It feels like it's been so long, but I missed watching him just fucking, like, decimate people. <laughs> All right, here's Carl Fartington and Ring announcing. Ladies and gentlemen, this match is an Extreme Rules match for the PXT Hardcore Championship. Why does he sound so fucking different in the ring? But, but hey, hey, Death, can I have your wallet? Because he wants fuck no, go fuck it fuck out your no. I want your wallet. No, no, no wallet. Face. I want your wallet. Give me your wallet. No wallet. I want the wallet, it's some bullshit. <laughs> Go back doing your job, you Carl, know. Carl, you have a box full of wallets, you're fine. That's some bullshit. Just, 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 just go to the back. Just, get, just go to the back. Take CJ's wallet. I can't, he scares me. <laughs> God damn. I won't lie, I'm actually very excited for fucking Operation now because see Jill's going against fucking Smooth. <laughs> I I am interested to see where that shit goes. Now Corey X up. Uh, still gonna talk to Corey about at least the top. We gotta we gotta we gotta we gotta we gotta, we gotta cover up uh a certain yes. target on his heart. <laughs> yeah. Mainly because that's what we're talking about with everyone. And he's the only one I guess you gotta do it. Yeah, what, what? Get the fuck yeah. Over. Never. Never. No. It's dollars to goddamn it, death. <laughs> 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 you fucking asshole. <laughs> Wait. Yes. Wait. Um. <laughs> wait. 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 Why is Desmond's door going. here? Yeah. Why is Desmond's door here? It's supposed to be Michael Wolf. Oh fuck! I know why. What's up with this? 
Oh no. This is not good. Oh no. Because we used an older version so we can get all the good Okay, no, I was gonna I was gonna set it up for you like some story shit. Thanks, Shane. You're welcome. Go fuck yourself. That means Michael Wolf does come through the door. Ah, ah. Just like everyone else! On that one episode. Yeah! <laughs> this door takes so damn long. Hey, it's still a pretty good entrance, fuck you. <laughs> Two members of the Unholy have held that title. But now, oh, the thing oh. is... Well, yeah, we had a trip for him. Well, no, two members now, because fucking Desmond. Oh, yeah. Yeah. No, I don't think Wildfire ever held the hardcore. He held the TikTok. That's Screw you, Michael good. Wolf, I hate you. Well, you know what? Well, You're not well, the first. <laughs> Michael Wolf becoming the hardcore champion at Bankrupt, now having to defend the title here tonight. I'm a whole lot of you. I'm fucking petrified. I'm not. Fuck you, Michael Wolf, you son of a bitch. I'm terrified. Michael Wolf, uh, I'll be honest with you, his record is not pretty. <laughs> I'm being 100% honest with you. His record's not pretty. Technically, uh -huh. his title victory at uh, Bankrupt was actually his third win in his record book. I think we all know what you have to say to that. Guess what I'm gonna say. I wanna point out, but some reason I didn't save the other, uh. Because I put the other attire, it still even saved that. This game sucks. You hunter and you smaller. He doesn't deserve that title, that's why I stared him down and bankrupt. Didn't he also beat the shit out of you? Uh, well, actually, Michael Wolf didn't really do anything of the actual beating. I mean, he just kicked him in the face, and then during the, fine. well, during the hold, pushed more, like, shit down on his throat. That was about it. <laughs> Death, you're a dick. <laughs> All right, here's Carl <laughs> Farrington in the ring. Introducing first, the challenger, Corey Axe! And the champion. He is the PXC Hardcore Champion, Michael Wolf. No, no, no. You gotta say it right. It's not. A, it's not a store brand taker. <laughs> Hurry? What? It's not a store brand taker for, uh, for Michael. Uh -oh. Eh, he's there. <laughs> there it is for BXC Hardcore title right there. Michael Wolf, Corey X. This is the first time ever these two competing off in PXC. And immediately Michael Wolf coming in with a big fucking knee lift straight to the skull of Corey X. It already sends. Oh my god. Since Corey spinning already, Michael Wolf taking full control of this match right now. And hits him with a backpack stunner. Yeah, that's right. I learned moves. It took years. I just still don't know that one. Hits <laughs> him with a catching knee lift. Right now, Michael Wolf already taking advantage of it being Extreme Rules match. Comes in with a chair. Corey, though, stopping him from using it. Now send him to the ropes. Oh, shit. Both collide, both men colliding with each other. <laughs> My ring announcers have fallen dead. They do not know what's going on here. But now Corey X getting Wolf into the corner for Snake Eyes. And now Corey sees the chair thinking about putting an end to Wolfie. Oh, oh catching Wolf on guard to get him with a steel chair straight to the face. 
Leon continues with a fucking shot to the back of Michael Wolf. I am still connected, right? Yeah, still connected. Okay, cool. Uh, I just want to make sure that nothing was going wrong since they're not saying nothing right now. All right, Corey X going for the pin off Michael Wolf. Michael Wolf immediately kicking out, though. Now, this is Corey X's day. Well, as far as I know, his debut here in PXT and already getting a title shot for it. That's actually a pretty good way the randomizer saves people. You know what I mean? <laughs> Right now, Corey on the outside, and Michael Wolf looking to go high risk, and it looks like it did not pay off. Like it falls flat on the outside. Now, oh, Corey was trying to get him with a cheap sh shot to the face. Doesn't get it though. Oh shit! Boy, catching him up for a lifting power bomb. And right now, Corey X has full control in this match and looking to get the steel chair once again. Uh oh, drops it. You know, just did die. I know. <laughs> Michael Wolf came in. They heard him talking shit. They're like, "Murder!" I have no idea. <laughs> I generally don't. I thought like maybe I disconnected, but no. Nah, I, I guess they're just quiet right now. That is something just happened. So either way, it is just Cyclone back in the old days, guys. Now Corey. Oh shit, Corey! Fucking doing a whole stretch maneuver off Michael Wolf, looking to see if that's gonna be enough to make him tap out, give him the title. Doesn't. Like you drew. But they got they got shot straight <laughs> from Michael Wolf with the spikes, which no the spikes are technically fucking pillows. Look man, it was the only way for him to look cool and make sure that nobody dies. Michael Wolf immediately getting a fucking ladder. <laughs> oh Corey, goddamn. Fucking drops him on his back. <laughs> My Wolf's trying to fucking pull off some big offense or big, like, maneuvers, maybe? I don't know. McCoy's just catching it with... Oh! Quick fucking offense. He's just a sexy Drew. Sexy Drew! Oh, shit! Coy with a big power bomb On the outside. <laughs> this is why we have the hardcore title, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, shit. Big gut shot, man. Corey, Corey is fucking making Michael Wolf <laughs> look like nothing right now. Shit. Well, honestly, Michael Wolf, honestly, I would be more scared if certain someone comes out in this match. You know what I mean? Because Michael Wolf already has a target on his back from his former member, Jacob Tristan Wildfire. And oh, misses the big boot. Oh, but catches him with a backhand. Oh, well, the bike got okay. Reversal after reversal. What the fuck? <laughs> I think Michael Wolf was trying to go for it. Was it final judgment or final uh, testament? Doesn't get it. Now, oh, gets him. Gets Corey X with his own X stabber. One, two, no. Oh, my Wolf picks up Corey and then just tosses him across the fucking ring okay. into the corner. <laughs> Sorry, I just had a conversation with my mom. Uh, but yeah, I'm just this. He's just a sexy Drew. Sexy Drew. He's not a boy So, so, oh my God. Oh God, God damn. Chair shot with the back, let's face first on the ladder. My God. Hey. How the fuck is Corey still alive? <laughs> no, Wildfire, I shall not. Shut up! Oh shit! Needs to commentate. <laughs> God damn it! Big punch right there, Corey. Honestly, Corey has had full control of this match this entire time. Holy shit! Big chair shot to the back. <laughs> but now the big thing is, Corey hasn't ha been able to hit any of his big maneuvers to really wear down <laughs> Michael Wolf. Oh, Wolf. Getting him with a toe. Oh my god! Dear god, that spine buster. You take it to choke slam, balance that you press, then to a spine buster. And now, oh my god. Now with the candle shots on the outside. This is where I think this, this type of matchup would be perfect for Michael Wolf because he can go as crazy as he wants, but Corey is no stranger to hardcore either. Damn. Damn. Yeah. 
Oh, no. Michael Wolf catching it with a big oh snap suplex. That was a snap suplex, you dumb fuck. I know. <laughs> Sexy hunt. No, <laughs> bad. No, that doesn't work with me. Wasn't what wasn't. Wasn't Mine is no chance. No chance is what you got. No chance in uh, Pixie. That too. God damn it. <laughs> Actually, we could disclose that, I guess. Uh, well, nah. I'll just let that be. For no, now. No, I was referencing Vince. I was just referencing Vince. Oh, that shit, yeah. <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? Okay, Corey's trying to get Michael Wolf back in the ring, but uh, Michael Wolf, I think, using his. Unholy powers, Unholy powers to Jinx. That wasn't even a jinx. I said it first. Then you just no, fucking uh, echoed it. it. You fuck literally, this. you literally echoed it. I said it first. Fuck this. Sixty wildfire. I won't even try. He's just terrifying. No. Yeah. No. <laughs> oh my god. Gig to the back <laughs> and lands back first on the steel chair. Oh god. <laughs> Good first landing on the hardest, well, the fucking pointy ass spot of the goddamn still steps. Holy shit. People are thinking about song. Yes, we are. Sorry, guys. Got myself muted because my nephew was near me, and so I'm watching him for a bit. Okay. Dear God, this damn chair. What the fuck? It all came in at once. It was scary. Dude, Michael Wolf is just punishing the shit out of Corey X. I'm assuming for the beginning. He dipped to the fucking chair. Oh, big boo from Corey X, and now bust open Michael Wolf. That's bad, especially in this kind of situation. That might be bad. Dude, Corey needs to not hesitate. Oh, big, was that DDT? Oh, look like a DDT. Oh, big DDT from Corey too. Michael Wolf, he needs to get him inside the ring if he wants to fucking win. It's the only way to get the pinfall. Ooh, I think he was trying to go for a jumping neck breaker. Doesn't get it though. Wolf, my back God! Back and forth and back and forth. Michael Wolf turned that neckbreaker into a choke slam. Now Michael Wolf getting Corey X back in the ring, and oh my God, Corey's on the ladder. Corey's on the ladder. Corey's on the ladder. He's off, and now gets caught with another chair shot to the back. Dear God! I think Michael Wolf's thinking that's enough to put Corey out. One, two, no, Corey kicks out. Michael oh, wait, but look at this. Oh, I have a holy punishment. Oh, unholy punishment. I think what Michael Wolf wants to do is just punish Corey by breaking a chair over his back again. What's he going to go for here? Oh, he's trying to go for a big fucking right. Doesn't get it, Corey, now. Trying to get the upper hand and catches him with a big Uranaki. Is that not the punt? Hey. Michael Wolf out of commission. One. Two! Ooh. No! Michael Wolf kicks out! Ooh, ooh, he's fucking back. Oh, Corey's getting an equalizer. He's getting a fucking still chair. Michael Wolf. Hey, what? Michael Wolf's using his unholy powers to protect himself from the multiple chair shots. Corey's just like, what the fuck? Good. There it is! It didn't last long! Three, Finally gets him back four, back to it. That was five, stupid. That was six, fucking stupid. Seven, he lost five. concentration. He's getting caught in all of them. That was seven. The reason I hate mystical wrestlers in WWE, anything that's stupid that happens in the game, he's magical! <laughs> but it works. It does. I just hate it, though. <laughs> it's like fucking Harry Potter. <laughs> oh my god! The Voldemort's still alive! How? I don't know, magic. <laughs> what? It was seven chair shots! Oh. Oh, Corey. Corey, looking to set up Michael Wolf on. No. Oh no, okay. I thought he was gonna set him up on the ladder. I thought we were gonna see another fucking Abkul. Shit, to where Abkul busted the fucking ladder on the back of Box. Still one of the craziest hardcore matches we've had. Here it is. One, two, no. Michael Wolf still kicks out, dude. No. Corey X punishing the shit. So, uh, um. either for the chair shots, I think Corey has the horrible aim of the chair, or Michael Wolf is just. Oh, hey, Corey, looking to... 
Oh, stop out the competition! Stops! Michael Wolf face first! That it! One! Two! No! Michael Wolf still kicks out! Dear God, stop it! And Corey going to the top! <laughs> Seizing up, sizing up, waiting for it, and out. oh, misses a big maneuver, Michael Wolf now gave the upper hand. Who is he going for? Oh, Wolf, Wolf's going straight for a chair, though. But, oh, Corey's catching him off guard, that is Michael Wolf's fault. He should have just fucking took more advantage of that opportunity. Instead, he's now getting Corey. Oh, wait, no, 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 okay, Michael Wolf. Using his unholy powers again, because I have no idea how he didn't get hit all those times. <laughs> Gets the chair, and oh! Face, face first with the chair shot, is that enough? Two, no, Corey's still fucking going! <laughs> Michael Wolf, I think finally getting frustrated, another ch chair shot straight to the Damn. face! Corey, Corey is still fucking getting up, dude. <laughs> This is this is a Mac and C. Oh, oh, Corey's on the ladder. Oh, Wolf is trying to go on the outside. Die, misses it. <laughs> oh my God, both <laughs> guys just got <laughs> fucked. He ain't total. But no, he said nothing but shit. Oh my God. Michael Wolf, uh, you ate everything. Is Corey it's gonna so get Wolf up? Is he gonna get him up on that ladder? No, again, just drops him face first. God damn it. At least put him on the ladder and do a dive. Come on, it'd be we cool. Ate shit, though. Break the oh, ladder. Man. Break the ladder. Shit. Look at his face. Break He's the a... ladder. Shut up. Look, man, it'd be cool. <laughs> it be we've, cool. Yeah. we've only seen it done once. <laughs> and the announcement table has been broken once, and you don't see me complaining. I don't think. Has it been broken? I was yes, actually curious. At Carnage. Oh yeah. <laughs> we haven't actually seen anybody break the announce table, yeah. Well like outside of a what's it called? Oh now. Coming in with a chair shot. Dude, that chair is fucked up. Oh wait, oh oh, oh Michael Wolf fucking oh what, what 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 is he tapping his ass? What the what the what the fuck happened? Dude, dude, Corey, oh Corey, Corey, what happened? Corey, oh Michael Wolf's fucking up Corey! Michael Wolf's evil fucking powers are kicking in! What, what the fuck's going on? Oh, he's 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 hitting him with the fucked up arm! This that's my strong hand! <laughs> <laughs> this match is both entertaining and the action entertaining with the fucking punches. Oh, I think he was trying to go for X. Oh! But gets him with Final Testament! Is that it? One! One two, two! No! He still kicks out! <laughs> <laughs> Michael Wolf holding the title proud. Oh shit, ah oh, guys, the lights went out. 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 Back up. And Wildfire has Wolf in the fucking Hell's Gate! He's just showing the living shell of Michael Wolf! Where's the devil? And Flood. Devil, Devil's coming straight to the ramp. Same thing with Desmond. They're both in! Lights out again. God damn it, lights out again. 
God damn it. Hold on to me, Dennis. I'm scared. Uh, I, I'm, I'm sorry. It'd it, it be okay, Shang. It'd be okay. Y'all are scaring Shang now. Fuck out of your lights, face. lights on. Wait, but Michael Wolf and Wildfire gone. Wait, guys, they're at the fucking. <laughs> they're at the entrance ramp. Michael Wolf's just fucking dangling. Wildfire holding his head up. It delivers the holy judgment off of Michael Wolf. <laughs> Dear God! And lights out and again. Oh my fucking God! They're on, and the wildfire's gone. He's just fucking decimated Michael Wolf right now. Holy Look at his big shit! Ass. Look at his big yes. ass. Yo, get some help out here! Don't help his ass. He just gave fuck. Yeah, for Corey. Get some help for Corey. Yeah, I say for Corey. Fuck, yeah, fuck Michael Wolf. Wolf's fine. Yeah, He's, he, yeah. he, he heals in like two Corey. seconds. <laughs> oh, man, dude. What the fuck? <laughs> Corey, do I have a fucking health issue? It's because it's like... <laughs> Alright, well... Uh, well, one, speak of the devil, because, uh, the next match involves devil, but now I gotta ask something, uh, with Shane. Shane, uh, from my understanding, you, you were able to talk to Shane Henry himself about the incident that happened at Bankrupt, where right, yeah. Rocky Mikado delivered his own silencer against him, knocking him out after his match with Jack Flo. What, what was his, uh, what, what was his, like, response about that? So, um... Uh... First, we have to clarify this one thing. This is Hooded Saber Shane talking about PFC Shane, because that gets fucking confusing for yes. everyone, including me. But uh, rephrase that, because I was like trying to. I was, like, <laughs> what, what are his thoughts about Rocky Mikado's return, and is he like in fear of that? He's, he's pissed, dog. He's pissed and in fear a little bit of both, too. Like, not, like it, he could fucking strike out of nowhere. And Rocky, Rocky could just strike out of nowhere. Yeah, it's gonna be fucking insane, dog. It's like, fuck. Oh, I mean, hell, I give him props, though. I mean, no, he has to be looking over his fucking shoulder constantly. He still accepted a match with the former TikTok champion, a Devil, here tonight. Of course. Make the party invite only! Wait, is it not invite only? What the fuck? Just realized that. But yeah, so There he is. Bane. Henry. Was able to pick up a win against his brother, his former teammate in the Outcast. Also, uh, your jacket does that a lot. My jacket does do that. It's inside you. It's inside you. It's inside you. Like how men are always inside of that. God damn it. <laughs> so, do, do, we, do, do we get a doctor? Or? Oh, no, it's fine. Oh, there it goes. It, it, it fixed itself. Yeah. Why are we talking about it? I don't know. Look, man. <laughs> <laughs> the last, the last match I haven't laughed that hard since the fucking crackhead in MTW. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> that whole match was crazy, and the perfect fucking explanation for it: magic. <laughs> magic. Uh, Michael Wolf. Fuck it. Everything. But yeah, now, exactly. I got some people. All right. Devil, now a former TikTok champion, but I want to point out he was the one to put down Electrobe, and who knows, maybe that started showing the cracks in Electrobe's arsenal. But Electrobe already proving everyone that he there is far from any cracks actually being in his fucking title reign because he 
was able to successfully defend his PXC championship against Anthony Morales at Bankrupt. Surprisingly, because honestly, I thought Morales had that match. Now, Devil did lose the title against Jay Wilson, who will be defending the TikTok Championship next week. I'm actually impressed that one, Shane accepted a match with Devil, two, Devil was no longer TikTok champion. Look, man, I thought he was gonna hold it a little bit longer. <laughs> Qualifier don't need hoes. God damn it. <laughs> no, because on MTW, uh, Drew made like a replacement wife character, but God, it was it was horrifying. It was horrifying. I was laughing for a good three hours. Well, two hours. Uh, hour? Hour. Oh, Shane trying to go full on and I, and I got on you. heavy on Devil. But Devil just flying him over his fucking shoulders. Let's try to take advantage. Devil, though, not getting it. And now gets him with a big knee lift. And Shane is in control of this. Lifting up Devil. Oh, shit. Oh! Head oh, first on the back Shane of his knee. Is, huh? She has this whole thing with silence. And, like, silence everyone. Is he the silencer? Like, what do we think he is? He is there. <laughs> Now the question is, can Devil pull off what Michael Wolf did in the last match? But we see Shane fucking get... <laughs> we see Shane have a seizure. That <laughs> was with my strong <laughs> hand. I'm sorry, I can't let it go. That shit, was, that shit got funny at the end. That shit genuinely got funny at the end. No, it was his arm freaking out and I'm trying to elbow him while his arm is like twisted, like shaking. I was like, oh. God damn it. No, I'm not man. strong enough. This is my strong man. <laughs> oh my god. <clears throat> Was Emma not good enough? She has been lost every match. She hasn't lost every match because she won a number of contendership. She almost won the women's title. And what's it called? So I, I won't say Emma's lost every match. But what Drew's saying is the key word there that you just said is almost. Ah, he said, look with Drew, he's almost lost all his matches. Don't lie. No. <laughs> this year, yeah, I know, he's made it a little bit better, but eh. I'll tell you, he has a better MTW record than PXT. Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. Look okay, yeah. there, it's Shane. Alrighty. That Getting the upper it. hand against. Oh, shit. Snap suplex from Devil to Shane. Oh, let's try to go over that elbow. Misses it. And Shane's catching him off guard. Oh, wait. Oh, my God. Doesn't drop Devil, though. God damn. The big punch. Now, again, one thing I want to point out. Devil is an exceptional striker due to his mentor, The Undertaker, who was known for his striking capabilities. Oh, Devil was trying to go for straight right to hell. I think Shane was trying to go for a big drop kick. Both men dodging big, dangerous moves. Lala. Shane though, yeah. oh, I'm able to connect <laughs> Assassin's Creed off of Devil. Ready with an Assassin's Creed. One, two. Only well, gets a two count. Drew, that sexy kick was like an RKO. It came out out of nowhere. Exactly. <laughs> oh, now, oh, big punch. And now Devil gained the upper hand, but Shane gained the upper hand again with a big clothesline, stopping the momentum of Devil. Big-ass clothesline. Devil now, rolling out. I'm gonna join NTW, to be honest. Next one! No, I'm joking. No, actually, uh, probably probably on the next episode, NTW, because uh, we are having our, oh! Survival of the Fittest, which is their big show oh, yeah. uh, later Dang tonight. Devil with the rolling gutter. And oh, another Assassin's Creed off Devil. Is that another put the former TikTok champion out? One, two, no, Devil's still going. Dear God, the resiliency of Devil. It's scary sometimes, I'm not going to lie to you. Now, I also want to point out Devil is actually going to be... Uh, be competing at Survival of the Fittest with Michael Wolf. I'm actually going to be surprised if he's actually going to make an appearance now uh, for the MTW Tag Team Championships. Mm -hmm. 
I know. I also want to point out we haven't heard any word about Michael Wolf and maybe his uh, um, him being upset with both Desmond and Devil with trying not just they to win the trying. bankrupt match. They did, yeah. but I mean, still, I mean, one person has a title, the other ones failed in their uh, big matches. Oh, and now connects with that elbow straight across the chest. And now a big leg drop to Shane. Dear God, that damn leg drop. He said that, what, three times uh -oh. now? Oh, what's this? Oh, a devil getting Shane into a dragon sleeper. Well, that ended, though. I don't know. Right now, this looks like Shane struggling to get out of the maneuver. Oh, there it is. Now coming in with shots straight to the temple of Devil's Skull. Dear God. Do oh. Not enough to stop the fucking control the Devil has in this match. Devil oh, God. Let's stop Shane. Oh, God. Drops him straight down. Oh, trying to go for another elbow across the chest. And Shane, again, another kick to the face and just sits. Devil's, <laughs> Devil's on face. Two-headed choke slam from Devil. Devil going to the top. Oh, my God. Big leg drop from the top. One, two. Shane kicks out. I was drinking my milkshake. Sorry. Oh, guys, I believe we're about to see a running devil! Oh, it connects! And Shane got busted open, but devil's not done! Devil's not done! Not done. Oh, it's trying to go for straight to hell, doesn't get it! Shane was able to get out of it! Uh oh, this might be it for devil! The Assassin's Creed! In the middle of the ring! Again! One, Third. two, three, and Shane picks up the win! All right, Rocky! Rocky! <laughs> Coming in and now attacking Shane! Wait, what? Wait, what the, what the fuck? What, what the hell did the steel cage come from? Where did the steel cage come from? <laughs> oh, this is it. Shane now fighting back against Rocky. Rocky wants a match with Shane in a steel cage. Oh, wait. Oh, I think Rocky was trying to retreat, but Shane's not holding back now. Shane now attacking Shane. Rocky McConnell. Yeah, a little bit of payback. And Rocky's out. Holy shit. And it looks like now it's even. <laughs> Holy shit, man. No, really. Where'd the steel cage come from, though? <laughs> oh, my God. God damn. Who had the fun? Who had the fun? I have no idea, man. I don't know where it came from. <laughs> Either way, congratulations, Shane. I'm picking up a big win against Devil. But, hell, a failed attempt from Rocky. But, God, that was creative as fuck, though. <laughs> he was like, he's not running. He's not running. But neither is he. <laughs> All right, but now, ladies and gentlemen, it is now time for the other half of the tag teams, Lucid Dragons and team of menace going one-on-one -on -one. And, and no if rodrigo wins here tonight against drew jeffrey it will be menace that has the stipulation call for the tag team championships in which i am going to announce this right now for the foreseeable future if my guys are in title shots or title picture shots like this for the tag titles i will actually lead this up to our discord uh discord server on what the match will be. We'll select three versions of the match that we like, and we'll pretty much set up a whole poll thing for uh, the Discord server. And whichever one wins, that will be the match for Operation. Now, another thing I also want to announce that I have been debating on, but I don't know if I'm actually gonna go through with it, but fuck it, let's see how it goes. We're gonna be, uh, well, correction, I'm gonna be doing a thing to where I'm gonna be asking for y'all guys' help for Operation PXT. What does that help, you ask? Y'all guys who have the chance to make the arena for Operation PXT. And we will have like a full on poll thing. If we like it, cool. If we don't or if nothing comes in, then, uh, well, I'll just use the one that I have saved. Um, pretty much the theme of it is going to be like the old fashioned PXT, which is, if you guys haven't seen the first ever episode of Operation, it oh, was what? red and black. That was the color scheme that we went with. So it's really red, black, gray. 
maybe a little bit of white, but those are pretty much the whole theme of it. If you guys want to actually be involved with that, go ahead and actually make the arena, upload it to Creations, put it under PXT. Well, in this case, put it under uh, PXT O. Then we know it's Operation PXT. So, just wanted to give y'all guys an opportunity for that because I think for Operation, since it's going to be such a big show, uh, I would like to see like what y'all guys bring to the table. And we will not say what the winner is. The winner will be revealed at Operation. But for, with that said, now it is on to the match. It is going to be the other half of Lucid Dragons and the other half of Menace. So you saying this, I can enter, enter the contest too? <laughs> Fuck no, Death. Fuck Damn, no. No, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> No, oh, technically yeah, you can. <laughs> that, technically, technically you can. Technically you can. And there he I is, can. the MTW United States Champion, which I also want to point out, where this could be the last time we see him with this title because later tonight at Survival of the Fittest, he defends that title against Mason Dixon. <laughs> Dane is dying. Finally, I'm joking. <laughs> Listen to the question. If you lose your title tonight, you're fine. No, no if you lose your title tonight, you'll get. So I want to point something out here. He is coming out by himself this time. I think the I think the match with Corey was too much and it actually like probably made him uh, not clear to come back out here. Or <laughs> Drew just wanted to uh be here by, by, by himself. I'm not sure. Also Hunter, can I use Golden Drew or not? I don't know what Golden Drew is. <laughs> what the fuck is Golden Drew? <laughs> it's just oh, the fuck is up with a championship in your jacket, fuckfit. You want to talk? Your jacket went in your body. Fair point. <laughs> the white pants and gold? That's a good question. What Are do you, you mean, okay? though? Are you okay? mm -hmm. God damn it. Baldrigo <laughs> again coming out. And as we saw earlier, he was pumped. Honestly, again, if you guys haven't seen Bankrupt and you guys didn't see the Bond match for the PXC Tag Team Championships, please go watch it. Because somehow, though Bugrip was the first one eliminated from that whole match, Rodrigo fucking soloed the entirety of that match to become PXC Tag Team Champions. But the one question is... What what happens if Rodrigo wins tonight? Do they get to pick the stipulation or what? Yes, that's what I'd say. That's exactly what happens. If Rodrigo wins here tonight, there will be Menace that picks the stipulation, which, like I just said before, will go straight to the Discord server with a choice of four matches that we will decide on. Reason I say that is because, here's the thing, these two guys are my guys, so it's, it's hard for me to pick a stipulation. I mean, I can pick it. No. <laughs> hey, look, hey, look, they're, hey, look, they're my guys. I get to decide how this stipulation gets decided. Like I, like I said, I I found a way to get it, uh, find a way for it to be stipulated instead of it being a cheap fucking way. It will be up to, it will be up to the Discord server. If, if Waldrio wins here tonight, if not, then it will be Bugrip against Drew next week. All right, here it is, the Blue Menace going against the fucking daddy of PXT. I'm not Andrew. calling him that. I will never call him that ever again. That fine, da this? fine. <laughs> Dashing Dragon, there you go. <laughs> Thank you. Th that happened during Abyss. Abyss was a lot. I want to point out though, Drew, Drew 101 combat wise and hell, even tag team wise, has shown exceptional work here in PXT. Hell, I think he's been shocking the world as of late. Hell, even in MTW, where he's seen a little bit way more success in MTW than here in PXT, I will say. I mean, he picked up the, he picked up the title. He picked up big wins. Hell, he had a great one on one against Electro. That he lost. Hey, he may have lost, but he gave one hell of a fucking fight. <laughs> Oh god, big fucking jumping clothesline. 
Shane, on the bright side, and this, this is actually true, on the bright side, you and him have something to share with Electrobe. You're both lost to him. <laughs> <laughs> he wasn't like, fun of like I did. Wait, wait, how are you made fun of? Do you not remember <laughs> MTW and PXC where I was double booked? Yeah, but I don't think we made fun of you. <laughs> oh, One! Two! Oh, that night! Hey, well, the end, to be fair, break your fourth wall, you literally asked for it. <laughs> I did. Right now, god damn, Drew's just fucking controlling the shit out of Rodrigo. Now, what he's setting up for his mega super sexy kick. Charging up the sexy kick. And connects with it off of Rodrigo. Is that enough to put down Rodrigo? One, two. No, my heart. Oh, that was actually pretty fucking close. I'm not gonna lie. For Rodrigo, that was actually pretty fucking close. And now Drew's actually, oh wow, oh there it is. Rodrigo now reversing it. Drew was doing great work keeping fucking Rodrigo in control. Now no, former PXT champion, want to point out, and Drew was fucking making him seem like a fucking newbie. But now the pure powerhouse offense of Rodrigo. Well, he oh, coming in the spear, mix. The same spear that helped him win. It's fucking... Actually, I don't think he. Oh, that's right. He did spear. No, he. You know, he bear hugged him. <laughs> he spear him like a full pond buff. Yeah, no, he, he bear. Actually, I just realized this is a grudge match right now in that whole thing because <laughs> Drew tapped out to a bear hug. Mm -hmm. So this is actually a rematch right now. <laughs> I did. I also did. Oh, and Rodrigo now coming in. Full on swinging with clothesline after clothesline. Now looking to pin the dashing dragon. One, two. I want to get the two count. Amen. Oh, Rodrigo on that. Oh my god. Showing his pure fucking strength. And now hits Drew with a fucking running power slam. It's still not done. God damn. And now Rodrigo looking to put Drew away. With the spin connects, is that on the put? Drew out. One, two, no. Drew kicks out. Both men kicking out of each other's big moves. Here. Oh, Rodrigo. Oh, with the Samoan drop. He's not even Samoan. We know. <laughs> not Samoans can hit the drop. And now comes it. Oh, it's trying to get from a top rope elbow. Doesn't connect with it. Drew now. Hit the spear. Hit the spear. Hit the spear. Andrew. Andrew come back at it though. Oh, and now comes back with the series of clotheslines. Now, Ari hits three. Oh, Drew goes sending Drew. There now, oh, gets caught in a spear. Yeah. Is that enough to put Drew out of commission? One, two. Three, and Rodrigo wins, and that means Menace gets the stipulation. Yeah, so if you guys want to actually be involved with what the Lucid Dragons and Menace will be facing off in Operation, y'all guys will have the decision in the Discord server. Uh, we're going to actually pick for... Uh, I think later this weekend, or probably even Monday, when the next episode of PXC comes out, um, we will actually well. decide. I mean, we still gotta look into it. But uh, but yeah, with that said, uh, that is the end of the match. We are not done with tonight, because our next match is a rematch for the PXC YouTube Championship! That's right, ladies and gentlemen, it is none other than G7 going one-on-one -on -one against Titan. G7 cashing in his rematch clause. Can G7 do, or can G7 tie the only man to be a two-time YouTube champion, C. Jill? Or will Titan continue his reign into operation against Iron Maiden? Let's go! Nice, come on. 
I say rock on. Because I like rock. You say nice. All right. Here's Carl Foyt in the ring. Ladies and gentlemen, this match is for one fall, and it is for the PXT YouTube Championship! Fuck you, Carl! Can I have your wallet? I want your wallet. Give me your wallet. Honor, I want your wallet. I feel like you're gonna touch me. I'm not. I just want your wallet. Give me your wallet. You're going for me. I want your wallet. No, no way! Okay, can I have your wallet though? No! No way! Just some bullshit. Okay, bye. Mm. Oh, I can't believe that. Dad, give me your wallet. No. I want your wallet. No way! Give me your wallet. I was about to go away, but he came back. Give me your wallet. No way! <laughs> give, give, me, give, me, give me your wallet. I want your wallet. I want it now. Come on. Give me a fucking bullet. No way. Oh, what the fuck are you doing? Go I want away. the wallet. You're not allowed to have the fucking wallet. Go go the wallet. You're not allowed to have it. I don't want it. Go, go to your fucking corner. That's some bullshit. Oh, uh, no way. Out, You're not allowed to tell me what I want to do. It's only he does because he's the one that owns me. So fuck you. I'm not going to my Did corner. You? Call, go to your fucking corner. Death, shut the fuck up. Call, go to your corner. Okay, okay you bye. Yeah. Outside, yeah, but if you tell him shit, he's not going to listen to my shit. So you got to shut the fuck up. No. No that's how, that's call, how he works. Call. Call, oh, he called me. I'm like Beetlejuice. I'm back, bitch. Hi. Uh, Carl, can you please just stop? No, because no, cause you called me. I'm like Carl, Beetlejuice. I call you, say you. My, you say my name one time, I come alive. I mean you sleep. I mean you sleep. Carl, can you stop? You literally just called me right now. Carl, no way. See, y'all are, 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 are still calling me. Y'all are still calling me. Y'all are still calling me. Waddington, corner, now. That's some bullshit. Oh, no, no. I got this. Death, got shut the fuck up! Shut You're making it worse! <laughs> You're gonna make him come back! Death! Shit if you can! Death, 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 he called me again, he said my name, hi. Oh my God. How's it going? I got a whole bag of fresh wallets for you. I don't like those wallets. They smell like you. You. Go away! Go away! Well, it's not my fault he keeps calling me out like Beetlejuice, goddamn. I'm not leaving yet. Fuck y'all. I gotta do my job. Give me a sec. Beep, 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 beep. <sighs> y'all, y'all had, y'all had to get, y'all had to get him. Y'all just had to get him involved. Y'all couldn't just let him be. That's y'all's fault. It wasn't my fault. Introducing the challenger, G Seven, and. His opponent. He is one half of domination, one half of the MTW Tag Team Champions, and one half of the YouTube Champions. What the fuck does that mean? Shut the fuck up. Tyron! I was so glad. Go away. He's already gone. I just like saying that. Now you know the name that should not be said. Go away. He's already gone. <laughs> Can I say it one more time? Or, or, he yeah. will come back and he probably will not leave. <laughs> oh, well. Hey. All right, here it is. Titan G7 for the YouTube Championship. And to oh, G7 already coming in straight oh, off the wow. bat. But Titan not allowing him to take control. All right, he said my name in the chat. I'm back. How's it going, guys? Way. I'm out of here. He said my name in the chat. That counts. <laughs> <laughs> so Titan's getting his ass whooped. G7 setting him to the corner. Go away. Oh, big elbow. Big elbow to the corner. Oh, oh shit. Go away. Oh, Titan just dropping G7's ass down. Holy shit. Go away. Holy crap. This is fucking crazy. Go 
Carl, Carl, I'll give you my wallet if you go away. Okay, proof. Where's the wallet? Right I need it physically here. in my hands. I give me that shit. That. Give me that I shit. Have a wallet for you, Carl. Here give me that go. shit. Here, lick. Here, lick. Uh, lick. Uh, here you go. Here you go. Bye, guys. Yeah. No, you have to leave now. Have to leave. That's what he made. did. He just licked y'all's wallets and left. That's no what he way. does. <laughs> he already left. No he way. licked. He licked y'all's wallets, gave it back, and he left. No way. He already left. Shane. I like saying it. Leave me alone. And damn it. Go away. This is why you do not bring back old fucking people that you fire years and years ago. It was six years ago. It wasn't that long. <laughs> it's technically. Oh, he called me away again. Hey, how's it going? Go away! Holy, sh holy shit. G7 on the on the barricade. He's getting his ass whooped. Oh shit. Time oh, calling in the middle of the ring. G7 coming back in the ring. Holy shit, dude. That's fucking quick, quick. Oh, big punch. Oh, big punch. Oh, big punch. Titan's fucking up G7. Sends it to the corner. Holy oh, shit. Oh, 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 oh missed a big splash. Oh, cool. I already licked it. Oh, 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 oh jumping shock DDT. Oh, it's a new oh, it's a new oh, it's new it's beautiful. It's beautiful. No, I don't like it. It's beautiful. Oh, look at this. G7 coming in with a. Oh, another future shock DDT. Oh, crazy. Go for the pin. Oh, one. Two. Oh, Titan kicks out. Oh. Crazy. G7 going to the top rope. Oh Carl, shit. Carl, what happens if I say go away? Again. Doesn't work. Oh, try to go for the elbow drop. Fucking missed. Oh, what a loser. Oh shit. You're getting caught with a fucking catching knee. Oh. It's a good back and forth between these two competitors. Holy shit. Oh. Hunter, Hunter. I'm, oh, I'm dropping you down. Oh shit. Stop. Hunter, I'm getting sick of it. Hey, it's your fault. You guys called Carl. Uh, he didn't do his death. And uh, I, I like Beetlejuice. Psycho, you say the name once. Too late, you fucked up. You fucked up, kid. I'll give you a 24 oh, karat gold wallet if you go away. Liz, I will give you a big ass good. Twix cake if you go away. Titan's just tossing the white guy around. Oh shit. I will give you a big ass Twix cake if you go away. There it is, the big bunches. Titan's just fucking up G7 left and right. Holy fuck. Carl, Carl, I'll give you a carrot cake if you go away. Oh, Titan going to the top. Oh shit. Oh, this is the big splash. What a loser. <laughs> Hunter, Got stop! Like a bitch. I swear to God! Oh, go get a clutch! Oh! Are we gonna see the big Hunter, fat man tap out? Come on, tap! Stop! I swear tap to out. God! Tap that shit! Oh. I'm being serious, Hunter! This is your punishment! Oh. <laughs> it's not even my fault! Uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure it was... Hey, yo, Cyclone, no. you want me to leave? Hey, they called you, so you get to stay! Oh, well... That's from the big <laughs> boss! <laughs> No, fuck this. Titan, Titan's now going cray cray. Oh shit. Damn. Machine is coming back. Death did it. <laughs> Big splash to the corner. Titan going for the pin. Oh. Here it is. You scared Shane off. Oh. Two. Oh. Only gets a two count. G7 still in it. Oh. This was is funny. When me cray -cray. Was that uh. funny? It was like, eh. Titan. Really struggling to keep up with G7 this time around. Can G7 pull off the victory of the light time? Oh, bust open oh, Titan. Oh up. shit. Please shut the fuck up. Oh, G7 missing like a noob. Uh. I swear to fucking God. Uh, okay, they had enough. They had enough. He can go. Okay. <laughs> That's what happens when no. you fucking do that shit. I didn't even do it. I didn't even say his name. I know, Death did. <laughs> he, hey, look, it's like Beetlejuice. <laughs> you write it, you say it, whatever, he comes out. <laughs> what if I think it? Oh, uh, I saw it. You were thinking. God uh, damn it. How's it going? G7 looking to make. I think your name. Lincoln's, uh, G7's looking to fuck up Titan. Come on, Titan. Uh, come back in it. Oh, shock DT. Oh, shit. Uh, jumping shock. Oh, shit. Is that enough? Uh, what? Uh, two. Uh, Fuck, god damn it. Uh, okay, you can go. Uh, David, think it. <laughs> I hate you. Just far for bringing him back to life. <laughs> I did it. I'm gonna kill him. <laughs> like I said, you mentioned the name once. He comes back. 
the reason he was fired six years ago. All right. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, G7 looking to go in for a King Slayer. Is that enough for the YouTube Championship? Is that enough? One, two. G7 is a two time YouTube Champion. And I want to point out because he won the title due to rematch clause. Titan will not get a rematch for the YouTube Championship. Until G7 loses the title. Well, I mean, unless he earns the title opportunity again, that's like the only way he can get it. So now it's going to be G7 going one on one against Iron Maiden for the YouTube Championship. Iron? At Iron. At Iron. Eh, whatever. Iron Maiden for the YouTube Championship. Iron. Eric found them. <laughs> going against Iron Maiden for the YouTube Championship at Operation PXT. Crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. And that is why. We do not bring up he who must not be named. It was my fault. Oh, this fits perfectly. <laughs> what? So, people don't know, Electro is the MTW World Champion. D-Mob, the try getting under the skin of Electro, has been trying to get a win off of Adonis. Electro has seen this and has not been impressed, so Electro has decided to challenge Adonis here tonight for the main event of PXC. Not cashing in. He is not cashing in. I want to point that out. That is not what this is. This is Electro versus Adonis. <laughs> oh my god. I have, We have not seen these guys compete since Electro made his debut. And Adonis was able to put Electro down. Adonis gave Electro his first defeat here in PXT. What the fuck? This is beautiful. <laughs> no, 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 no. His first lost. Oh, you said win. I, no, I, I said win. No, I said loss. Yeah, because uh, Electro was trying to help out his brother, but no, nah, that's not what happened. I'm so mad I got cheated out of the PXC title because of Electro. <laughs> there's a lot of, there's a lot of people. There's a lot, there's a lot, there's a lot of people pissed off at Electro, actually. Uh, G7 is the YouTube champion once again, and uh, Titan will not get a title rematch for it because due to the rematch clause. Hey, Electro, Electro, fuck you. Oh, sorry. No, I'm looking at my text because uh, the guy that does my haircuts asking for I want one at um on Wednesday, which I might be down because my hair is getting thick. I don't like it. During summertime, I don't like it. Electro, the double crown world champion right now. Both PXT and NTW world champion. Hell, honestly, I literally not gonna lie to anybody here. I legitimately thought Electro was gonna come up short against Anthony Morales, but Electro, being who he is, was able to put him down. But now the question. Sorry, go ahead. Badly. Yeah. I, I, can, I, I can hear what the fuck could be mad because it was like not even last week or four days ago. But if that was for a frost fight, get over yeah. it. God damn it. But no. Uh, <laughs> get over it while I'm God damn it. But no, uh, but no, I do, I, I do want to point out. I do want to point out. Um, can Electro. Right or wrong, if you will, because Adonis is right now Mr. Bankrupt. And this is this is not for the PXC Championship. That's not what this is for. He did not cash in Bankrupt. So he is still Mr. Bankrupt. For some reason, he doesn't come out with the briefcase. I don't know why. 
So in other words, anytime, any place, Adonis can cash in. Well, correction, he can invoke the bankrupt briefcase and attempt <laughs> to bankrupt Electro of the PXD Championship. In other words, normal money in the bank rules with that shit. He's gonna track me down. I'm taking that as a threat. And that's kinda illegal, man. God damn it. <laughs> He's saying no, it as the character. I'm fucking serious. Oh, hey, lovely. Oh, my God. Never mind. Good him. Okay, I'm still mad. I got you. Okay, Shane, I will track you down, tricks me. Metaphorically. What are you saying, metaphorically? You know what I'm gonna text him? Jesus. No. It's one of my favorite things to say. All right, here it is. Electro Adonis. <laughs> Going back at it once again, Adonis catching Electro with a big fucking clothesline into the corner, and look at this, Adonis! <laughs> I think Adonis is actually a little jealous of Electro because Electro's career has been kick-started. Knock the shit out of him! Big Knock time! Knock the shit out of him! To where Adonis has been fucking stuck being a goddamn mid corner for the past fucking... Oh god, how long has VXD been going for? Months? Oh, missing the springboard forearm. And now Electro coming up with control and smacks the shit out of Adonis. Immediately goes for the pin, thinking that... <laughs> I don't think he thought that was enough. I think he's playing a little bit of mind games with Adonis. I would too, because fuck Adonis. Oh, Adonis. Wait, wait, no, no, Adonis immediately with an Adonis drop. <laughs> what? Oh, shit, one. Oh, so... That was a one off Adonis drop. What the fuck? No, that wasn't the true Adonis drop. He like oh, shit. No, that, no, that was the Adonis drop. <laughs> that that yeah. was the Adonis drop. He has Mach 2 and the Adonis drop. That was Adonis drop. Excuse me. Holy shit. Electro, the bitch. Electro, you're a bitch. Maybe a bitch. And now gets Electro, caught in the springboard the form. Electro, the bitch. And now Adonis coming in with shots and a kick straight to the gut of Electro, but Electro has to roll out. Adonis, though, not, not giving up. Immediately follows after Electro, but now caught into a cross on DDT. Now Electro back at it. Now, no, this was probably the only loss Electro has really suffered in his career that really set him back a bit, but not completely. Oh, big punch from Electro. And now continues the onslaught. Oh, Adonis immediately rolling, getting back in the ring, but bringing up the count. Oh, okay. Electro misses that shot. And now Adonis gets the upper hand. Oh my God, close to probably killing Adon uh, Electro a little bit there. Electro now sending Adonis back into the middle of the ring. By the way, Adonis coming back at it. Now looking to set up for a Kanzon straight across the chest of Electro. Is that enough? No, his long legs save him. Yeah. Oh, Adonis was trying to come in probably for it. I don't know, I guess a suplex, I really don't, or a leg drag suplex, I don't know what to call that. Oh, misses the, oh, Adonis dodges the lightning talon. Oh, the first man to dodge it. This could be his moment. Well, no, because I was going to say a lot of people have dodged it, actually. Oh, look at this. Oh, a big springboard drop kick. And again, Electro just smacking Adonis across the face. And now comes in with the punches straight to the face of Adonis. Your brother, god damn it. That that, that wait what? Is, wait, why wait what? Oh! Grenada dodges the electric talon! Adonis has done his homework and here it is another! Adonis drop! And this time busting open the PXC champion! One! Two! No! Kicks out! Adonis and I'm confused a lot. I'll be honest with you, I generally do not know how. <laughs> One wears long sleeves, the other one <laughs> doesn't. Oh, this time getting caught in a lightning talon! Because they're both like black attire. One! And their two! A. And then it's a B and a D, so like. Donis kicks out of the lightning talon. 
That, I think that's not good because now Adonis has a lot more control in this match than Electro does and immediately attacks the bad leg of it. Oh, big knee lift straight across the skull of Electro. Adonis going to the top. Comes in with a, oh, misses the big knee to the face. You dumbass. And now You're Electro dumbass. taking advantage. You're a dumbass. Oh, Electro You're going to the top. And now coming over the oh, was misses the big elbow straight to the spine. And now Adonis looking. You look at the upper hand. Oh, big shot straight to the back of the skull. Oh, he cash in. Oh shit, if he wins here, technically he should have cashed in. <laughs> you didn't set it up, did you? Well, because I get to decide when, so I'm not, it's not going to happen anytime soon. <laughs> God damn it, Hunter. It would have been perfect if you set it up for after the It would have been perfect because that means it would have been Mason versus Adonis at Electro. <laughs> at Electro? And Electro. It would have been a triple threat match at Operation. That's, that, I'm good. <laughs> And now on, oh my, oh shit! Damn. That was an out, that Alabama looked like it almost hit the fucking hardest part of the ring right there, holy shit. I think he did. Oh, look at this, Adonis now looking to rally here against the PXC champion. Oh, big heel kick! I think that's enough to put Electro Battle Commission one! Oh, the champion thinking smart grabs the rope. He's, he might be a dick, but he's smart. Both men, former WWE champions. Oh, wait, look at this. Adonis going for a Mox 2. That might be it. I think he put down Electro. One, two. No. Electro kicks out of the Mach 2. This is a fast paced uh, match going on. Like Adonis. Like oh, Adonis. Him. Thinking of ending it with the hands on it. That might be it. That might be. He's won titles that he hands on before. And yes, it was enough to put Electro down! Electro! Electro knocked the fuck out, finally getting up. Grabbing his title. Oh wait, what's this? Wait. Mason! Coming in, looks like also talking a little bit of disrespect. What's up, fuckface? Nah, I'm, nah, I'm just kidding, that's not his voice. I think Mason's saying the cracks are fucking showing. <laughs> Electro, even though losing, not phased at all. Damn. So, want to point out, want to point out, choice. both men were not able to defeat Adonis. That proved that shows something about Adonis, man. Damn. So Adonis has shown that he can end Electro's reign whenever the fuck he wants. Damn. Well, with that, ladies and gentlemen, that is the end of PXC. Uh, we will be going live in a good, I want to say, hour. So in other words, sometime around 6, maybe 6.30. Because we're about to set up uh, Survival of the Fittest. That's going to be on MTW. If you guys want to check that out, you guys can go to MTW because we're about to make the stream thing on there. Um, with that said, we all have title matches. Uh, I will name the title matches that are happening on MTW Survival the Fittest. We have Domination defending the MTW Tag Team Championships against the Unholy with Devil and Michael Wolf, even though Michael Wolf got brutally assaulted by um, Diggle Twisted Wildfire, so I don't know how that's going to go. Then we have uh, the mixed tag team titles, Michael Slade and Ava defending them against Mox and Jimenez. That's going to be it because that means Jimenez and Ava, we get a sneak peek at that one-on-one -on -one at Operation. We're getting a sneak peek of it at Survival of the Fittest. Then for the Hardcore Championship, we have Box going against the TikTok Championship and the MTW Hardcore Champion, Jay Wilson. That's going to be an interesting one, too. Can Mox become a hardcore champion once again, but this time at MTW? Then we have the U.S. Women's Championship being defended uh, by Queen Amy going one-on-one -on -one against Misty Wolf. Mason and Drew will compete for the U.S. Men's. Corey X and Michael Slade for the IC Championship. Jesse and Lenore for the IC Women's. And then the big two matches. Danielle 
versus Sarah Fox, the NTW Women's Championships, and the big one, can D-Mob correct the wrong that happened at the MTW tournament to where Electro not only disrespected d but disrespected his pappy at the MTW tournament. Can d correct the wrong against him for the MTW World Heavyweight Championship? We'll find out literally later here tonight. But those are all the matches. You guys want to check them out? Go on down to MTW. Go ahead and follow them there. It helps them out tremendously. I ought to do the work there as well. It will be me and Death doing the commentary for that show. So if you guys want to go in and check that out, it would be great to see you guys there. But for right now, this has been PXC. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out. Take care. Y'all guys have a great night.